Hello all, it's time for another train show here on the RWTX YouTube channel. Today we are in Garden Ridge, Texas, which is a suburb of San Antonio. Uh, this show was uh, just pa this past weekend, uh, February the 25th. It was actually a two-day show, but I was only there on the first day. So let's get our way in here. This show was actually hosted, um, or I guess you'd say put on by the San Antonio um, Model Railroad Association. SAMRA is their acronym. Um, and they actually were one of the vendors. Um, but you can kind of get an idea of what they had. This first person had quite a bit of stuff. Um, some good Genesis locomotives, which I would say are you weren't going to get a good deal on them. They were pretty uh, pretty retail-ish. Um, this table to the right is actually where the uh, train club that hosted the show was at. They had good prices. And just going around, I saw quite a bit of uh, quite a bit of in scale. There was actually some of the same vendors at this show as there was at the previous show, which does happen, but there were definitely some different ones as well. Um, in terms of, like, a table count, I counted right around 70 tables at this show, which is fairly small. I mean, as you saw when we first walked in, kind of got an idea of the of the entire room, and you might have saw the, uh, you know, one wall to the next was not a huge distance. Um, they had about, I think, three, three layouts. Let me think. One, there's one to our right, right now. It's an in-scale layout. And, uh, it is, you know, cool little layout. And you can just put on the table. Very mobile. Gotta like those. Everybody likes in-scale for that reason. Um, this is a good-looking layout. I like that bar in there. Um, also at this show was um, Spring Creek Model Trains. They were the only, you know, big big dealer, I guess you'd call it big player, and they kind of had their own room. And that 70 tables that I mentioned does include theirs, um, which, you know, they really they really fill their tables up because they have shelving. Um, but we'll, we'll go into there and check it out. Again, the left was all in scale, and then HO was the rest of the room. And I just wanted to check out one specific thing when I went in here, and I'm about to look at it right over here they had the new class one models um intermodal stuff you can see the containers there there's a triple crown and then here are the well cars so if anybody gets a hold of one of those um leave me a comment and with maybe even a picture if you can because those are pretty uh, pretty cool i'd like to like to get one at some point um just more spring creek stuff you know they they keep things well stocked even even on their train show route. Now we're back out in the uh, into the general area and kind of walking along the back side. I guess there was only two layouts at this show, um, but it, uh, it it filled out well. Um, the admission for this show was eight dollars, which you know compared to the last show was high, especially considering how small this show was in comparison. Um, but they did give free admission, I think. They did give free admission to veterans, so that's that's always good. Um, but in comparison to the last show, this show was, you know, it was lacking. But in, in general, this was a decent show. I drove four hours for this show as well. Um, probably wouldn't want to drive much further than that for this show. But it was um, it was still a fun day. I actually went and uh, visited the uh, the Samra um, clubhouse, I guess you'd call it, which was also pretty fun. Might have to do a video on that as well at some point. Um, I did like this layout, though. There was quite a bit of uh, detail going on. And uh, as I was recording, he was um, working on putting an intermodal train on. So, of course, I had to stick around and um, I'm going to say help. Usually I just talk, but, uh, but so this layout was pretty nice. I like this bridge. 
But anyway, since we're getting close to the end of the video, a couple more things I wanted to mention was um, I, I mentioned before about the uh, previous show and how this one relates to it. Um, check out the link at the top right of the screen right now to uh, go check that out if you'd like. Um, also, I would say HO, N, and o, o scale were about the only things that I saw. I don't think I really saw any S or any G or any Z. Um, the show was just probably just too small in order to include that kind of thing. Um, but uh, that's pretty much all I have for you today. Um, I guess I'll just kind of let you check out this uh, this video, this pretty cool scene with this bridge right here. And um, But that's all for the day.